what's up guys what's up guys well i won't be staying long on this intro i'll be chopping it up really quick well today i will be cooking some red sorry guys some stew peas made out of strictly pigtail no other meat involved in my stew peas with some carrot juice and rice rice if you want to see how i'm gonna put it down please stay tuned for the video also guys i think you really want to watch this full out because i will be showing you how to season your pigtail um this way you'll be using less powder seasoning and more natural seasoning to give it the flavor that you want without using a lot of powder seasoning because what you, when you're cooking stew peas with pigtail you have to be very careful of the amount of seasoning powder seasoning you use because it will bring back the salt back out in the stew peas if you understand what i'm saying if you get it if you get it you get it right so with that being said if you want to see how i gonna do this stew peas you need to stay tuned for the video watch the full video guys and please remember to like like up the video them guys like up the videos comment and subscribe to the channel to all my new viewers and my supporters and and my subscribers thank you guys so much for keep coming time after time to see the videos to view the channels and to share the videos i love you guys i appreciate you to the max all right so build with me guys i know it takes time journey takes time so you know just continue come on this journey with me share like comment and subscribe on the channel guys love you guys stay tuned for the video okay guys so this is my pigtail i was um i put it to soak a bit and this is my peas that i'll be using so the first thing i'm going to do is to strain off this water because we're trying to get rid of much salt as we possibly can so um i'm gonna give it a wash a little wash Call our pigtail off. So we're going to be calling the pigtail. Okay, guys, we don't need so much water. We're going to get some of this water off. We're going to set it on. Then we're gonna uh, we're gonna cover. Okay, guys. The second thing we're going to do is to um get the peas into this pot. I'm going to put some more water and leave it there to soak. We're just gonna leave it till the pigtail is ready. All right. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. So we're going to check on this pigtail now. And as you see, um, I think I want to give it a second, a second scald. I want to give it two times scald. Okay. So I'm going to. I'm going to throw this off. 
Set it back. Give it some more time to scald again. Right. In the meantime, guys, we're going to get this thing tidied up. the sink out. So now we get our sink cleaned back up. Okay guys, so now that we finish cleaning, make sure everywhere is nice and clean. We're waiting on our pigtails to finish hold off. Okay guys, we'll be right back. Okay guys, so now we're going to add this. Um, as I said, we have a lot of garlic in this mixture, but I'm going to put some more garlic because I love to cook with a lot of garlic. So, we're going to add this to the stew peas now. Um, 
we have a Okay guys, so now I'm going to be grinding. So I'll be adding these garlic into the mixture. And then we're going to add our way to cook. Here's my peas. Okay guys. Okay guys, I'm so sorry I did not get to show you what I'm doing with these carrots. Okay, I washed, cut up these carrots to blend. Um, so we are going to be Guys, this blender is the strongest blender I see for a very long time. I buy two blender that burned up and leave this one. This is really a strong blender. when I boil the carrot guys but the way I'm gonna make it I don't like when it's too thick and the kids don't like when it's too thick too so I just decided to just cut and boil <laughs> Okay, guys. What we're going to do is pour back some of this juice in the blender. In this mixture, you can add a Guinness, a Malta, whatever you feel like to add to it. Guys, I want it very simple, so I'm going to go ahead and add my um, I'm going to go ahead and add my last call. Uh, Guys, I go, went go ahead and add my last call to it to the mixture. And then I'm going to go ahead and add my milk, which is my tin milk, Betty. Oh. Okay, one second, guys. Is it possible that friends saw or went to see as a woman? There is. 
that scene. Well, isn't it? First you joke about Betty and now this. Okay, guys, so I'm adding my milk. Um, Somewhere. Stalking a woman. Stalking. Not gonna need all of this milk because. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, it's not a lot of juice. Then I'll be adding a teaspoon of cinnamon. You can add some vanilla as well. Vanilla is really good to add to this mixture. So you're gonna add some vanilla, some cinnamon powder to this. So a teaspoon of cinnamon powder. As I said, you can add some lime juice. You can also add some lime juice, just a little bit. That is talking. That's it. And then we're going to be blending this together, guys. Okay, guys, let's take this. Because we have, we're gonna just pour the balance in here. Then we get our carrot, carrot juice, guys. Very simple juice, guys. Simple. Hmm. Tastes good. Okay, hey guys. So what we're gonna do is pour it in our container and put it to cool till dinner time. All right, guys. Here we have the juice. So we're gonna pour it into our mug. Got our messing up the place, guys. I'm messing up. Okay, guys, let's see how far our. Okay! I hate to mix my peas, guys. I think this peas was mixed. Anyways, we're going to put in our um, coconut milk and allow it to cook right here. Normally guys, if you know me and you know my cooking skills and you know when you've watched my channel, you will know that I'm a natural, I love natural coconut. But for today, I will be using our Maggi coconut powder, alright? I'm going to use just a little bit of water, not much, just a little bit. Don't want too much because we already have that amount of water in our pot. This to our cookies. Then we're gonna allow it to cook. So you feel that? 
okay guys so this is our flour and our salt and water now we are going to make our Jamaica we call it spinners we are going to make our spinners guys this is the dough this is my dough so now we're gonna add it to the strippies allow it to cook all the way down we we'll soon come back to season the pot okay guys now we have our scallion the only thing i'm missing from this is a nice scotch bonnet green pepper but never mind that for today Now I'm going to put some Maggi chicken. Guys, I don't like a lot of powder seasoning. I cook with more natural seasoning than I cook with powder seasoning. I, as I, at the beginning of it, I already put in some seasoning in it. My blended season. So now we're just spicing it up a little bit. That's um, our muggy all purpose Jamaican season. Now I'm gonna put a little bit more precious pimento. Not a lot, just a little because we put some in there already, so to just put a few more. Okay, so we're gonna add that to it. Just a little bit. 
I know that to cook right now. We're gonna add some butter. Yeah. We're gonna add our golden Jamaican butter. That's a lot. We're just gonna allow it to cook right down. I know it's a cook, guys. Guys, okay, so now we have um, in the here we have garlic and scallion, and we're going to add our rice. to add just a little bit of butter I'm gonna take some of this water out okay guys I'm gonna take a little bit of this water out right I had a little bit of my golden butter. I'm gonna allow it to cook. Let's just take another look at our cookies here. Okay, guys, it's cooking down, it's going down. Okay, guys, now this cookies is finally coming together. So we're going to allow it to cook some more, turn it down on low flame. Okay guys, now that we're almost finishing, I'm going to add some, some black pepper because it's about to finish. So we're going to add some black pepper. Guys, we have come to the ending of our stupies. So I'm gonna turn off this fire right now, guys, because it is finished. Okay. Okay, guys, I am finished, and this is the stupies. So you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm going to let the kids them read the dinner okay guys i'm gonna let the kids them tell me how they like their stew peas and okay it tastes nice tastes nice joshua okay